In this demonstration, we're going to show you how you can protect the source code for your Simscape language components. Here's our situation. I'm an engineer working at one company, and I've created a component using the Simscape language. I would like to share this component with an engineer at another company. However, I do not want to share my source code with this engineer. We're going to see how we can use the commands SSC protect and SSC mirror to protect my intellectual property. In this example, we have a package directory with subdirectories that are full of Simscape language components. I could use the command SSC protect to convert a single Simscape file into a protected file that has a binary format that the other engineer can't read. In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how we can use the command SSC mirror to convert not only the package directory, but all of the subdirectories and their contents into a protected format. I'll now switch over to MATLAB so we can see what this looks like. You can see in the sub package directory custom drive train that we have sub package directories that include different elements. If I open up the library which we have already built, we can see those sub libraries and inside we can see the components. Here we can see in the clutch component that I have the source code for this component which I have written. Now I'm going to show you how we can use the command SSC mirror to protect this entire library. So I'll enter the command SSC mirror and I'm going to mirror the custom drive train package directory and subdirectories to another directory called shared library. The mirror is now complete and if I go to the shared library directory which has been created we can see that we have all of the subdirectories that we were looking at before and if I open up the source code for this clutch file that we were looking at we'll see that it is now protected. This is a binary file that other engineers can't read. Now to see what this looks like in one, once we build the components, I'll use the command SSC build to build up the entire package directory and sub package directories. When the build process is complete, we'll have a new custom drivetrain underscore lib.mdl, which will be in the shared libraries directory. I'll make sure that I open the right one, going down two levels. Here we see the same sub-libraries that we saw in the original model, but when I open up the clutch model, we see that the link to the source code isn't there. So I can see that this component is now protected, and I can share this with engineer other engineers without exposing my source code. 